The situation between India and China is still very tense. If things escalate further, many are wondering how other countries are going to react, especially those countries which India has a good relationship with. One of those countries could be Israel, a nation which has an important strategic partnership with India. According to the Israeli analyst Seth Franzman, in general, India has very good relations with countries that Israel has good relations with, including South Korea, Japan, Singapore, and also Gulf states that Israel shares interests with, such as the UAE and Saudi Arabia. He adds that Israel's continued integration into India's economy, especially joint venture defense deals and working with the Make in India approach of defense manufacturing, indicates the future that will see greater Israel, India and US cooperation on defense technology and potentially strategic issues. But then he also says that, at the same time, Israel will continue to have relations with China and look keenly on China's growing economic clout. As far as Israel's China policy is concerned, it is mostly about economic, scientific and technological cooperation, while avoiding activities that angers the US. Yes, the real pressure on Israel is from America and not from India, but at some stage, this may change. It should be noted that China even became Israel's largest trade partner and one of the top sources of foreign investment. Some have even suggested that if Israel continues to deepen its ties with China, at some stage it may be forced to choose between America and China. But will Israel want to choose China if America also brings India with it? The 2015 Haifa port deal has granted a Chinese company to operate the Israeli port for 25 years. This made America so upset that it even went on to say that it may not be able to continue joint naval exercises with Israel in the same fashion if it continues to go ahead with the Chinese Haifa port management project. In January 2019, Mike Pompeo said that if Israel does not reduce cooperation with China, the US might reduce intelligence sharing and co-location of security facilities. America and Israel have had two confrontations in relation to the transfer of Israeli military technology to China. It is well known that Israel played a role in modernizing China's military. According to former director of the Central Intelligence Agency, R. James Woolsey, Israel has sold advanced military technology to China for more than a decade. Mr. Woolsey said this in the early 90s. After the sale of the Falcon AWACS to China was cancelled back in 2000, the USA put pressure on Israel to not sell any military equipment to Beijing. Today, the US is worried that China will eventually obtain access to the lines of communication that the US utilizes to communicate intelligence with Israel. These concerns are mostly because China is building almost all of Israel's infrastructure, including tunnels, ports, roads and trains, in addition to various others. It is important to point out that China also sells weapons technology to Israel's Middle Eastern adversaries. Shouldn't this concern Israel? According to Franzman, economic power is rapidly shifting to Asia, and Western countries are becoming more chaotic and unstable. Israel's key alliance is with the US, but Israel's key relationships are also in Asia, and they will continue to be. He adds that India and China are key countries and Israel wants a growing strategic partnership with India and amicable relations with China. So if Israel does go that way, it will remind us of the saying, nations have no permanent allies, only permanent interests. See you again.